VS Code's timeline view lets you see all of the commits that were made to the current file. Now, if you want to investigate one of these commits, you can just go and click on it, and you get a nice diff view here that will actually show the individual changes that were going into this commit. Now, one recent feature that VS Code added is that you can also now compare across multiple commits. So you can see all of the changes that happened between two different individual commits. Now, to start with, you need to go and select the first commit that you're interested in. So let's go over to the timeline view here. And I'm going to start by saying, I'm interested in this commit here. So I'll right click on it and say, select for compare. So this is sort of the starting commit. And now I need to select what I'm going to compare it to. And this can be anywhere in the timeline. So I'm going to go up to the starting commit up here, right click on that one, and then say compare with selected. So now what VS Code is showing in the diff view here is the all, uh, set of changes that actually occurred between these two different commits that I selected. So between the one down here and the one up here. So you can see here it's showing all of the code that was removed and added between these two individual commits. It's sort of like a composite view of all those individual diff, diff views that we get by clicking on the individual commits. You can just browse through all of the changes here. And this gives you a good overview of what it was actually changing. And in this case, in the last six months or so. Select for compare is useful if you want to see what changed between specific points in time in the file's history. So let's select for compare in VS Code's timeline view. 